Hey, good morning. I hope you're doing well. Today it's Tuesday and I had some thoughts about life and hopefully I can help you as well to live your dream life and just making a reminder that you are more than good enough and that you keep on that you keep on living your best life in reality. In case my voice sounds a little bit strange, I'm sorry for that. I have been suffering from high fever. Like this period has been a little bit um, hard with, um, yeah, with insomnia, but also with high fever because it's kind of strong with the allergies, and also has like a little bit of anxiety going on. But today I want to make this video that. No matter what uh, people say or what you experience is that don't let anything or anyone stop you from doing things that make you feel happy. A few years ago, I started to do things differently because, you know, I don't want to live my life in a way of other people tell me what to do or like preventing me from being my happiest version because I think Every day you can work on yourself that feels very good to you and that you can be a positive example for yourself and other people too. For me, it is really inspiring to think like this, that, you know, every day it's a beautiful day, it's a new day, you can do whatever you want that makes you feel happy and keep that every time in mind that, you know, you can do a lot of things in a day, maybe even more than you even realize. How awesome is it that in a whole year you can do so many things and you know really enjoy your life for real there's so many things that you can celebrate i had this year i had last week my birthday and i still have the stingers or the celebration things on in my apartment as an inspiration that you know you can live your life every single day as your birthday and make your birthday even more special this helped me so much, especially as one of the moments that I sometimes feel anxious about things or I feel like sad. Luckily, um, I've switched to think about 95% of things that do go well rather than focusing only on the 5% that don't go well. I think when you do already that and you keep on thinking about that, that you know, by focusing on 5% of negative things, I mean, not running away from them because I feel like that might then only make things worse but focusing on things that make you feel happy and there are way more things that you might even realize whether they are big or, or small because all beautiful things that make you feel happy whether they are small or big they end up in a really big positive so this is something that i keep on having in mind every time that you know there's so many things to be grateful for instead of focusing on the weather in the netherlands because, yeah, sometimes it gets really rainy here in the Netherlands. I can better focus, like, how how things are. Like, what I really like, for example, is that people in general are very open-minded. They are punctual. You know, I like that. Or, for example, a lot of things are good organized. It is uh, quite safe to live here. We have drink water. We have more than enough food. There are a lot of good things. I had a bus that came only once a once an hour, not once a year. <laughs> Sorry, that came only once an hour, and here it's like, well, but actually, it's so much better because every five minutes or every ten minutes you have a bus, and even if it has delay of five minutes, it's still there. It's so much better because when I was in uh, in Slovakia, I remember I had a bus that went only once an hour, and m the bus had bad connections. <laughs> From the capital to the uh, to my grandfather's city so i had to wait one hour but the good thing is that there was a there was a shopping mall in close to the bus station and like next to the bus station so instead of uh waiting one hour in the cold i could stay like in the shopping mall so that's also positive you see with everything they can be also positive and you know what the best thing is is that like it doesn't matter which month it is you can always live your best life in reality if you allow yourself to live your best life in reality 
because I know that at least what happened to me before is that I made these beautiful goals at the end of the year for the next for the next year and then in January I just start nicely and sometimes I couldn't do certain things but I'm like okay maybe there are things that I couldn't do in January but I can still do them in May or in August or in September doesn't matter right as long as you keep on believing in yourself and keep believing in your goals and things that you want to do you can always do them and whether you, you practice these things once a, once a week or once a day doesn't matter I think you have always the opportunity to do things that feels right to you so my question for you is what do you want to experience this year you can write them down you can even visualize it like by daydreaming like how do you want to look certain things I think that can also help you to take the actions because I think the more you focus on this you have more chances to have them as well in your life